hello everyone welcome again and uh, today i'm going to show you uh, the, my existing project is online voting system in this uh, system i in this project i upgrade some admin uh, admin panels admin modules so again i'm going to show you the same project but some different module i add in okay so just i'm going to run this pro project for using uh, for developing this project i use completely netwin ide uh, for the development, the web development, you can also use it's very easy and um, most usable uh, ID. And next thing is, I'm using JSPs and uh, servlet pages, some servlet pages here. And for J database connectivity, I use MySQL database. And uh, for uh, connect the database to Java application, you have to import this library MySQL Java, um, MySQL connector Java, and uh, for run on local host, I am using Glassfish server. You can use Tomcat and uh, as you want. Okay, uh, so just have a look. Just I'm going to run this project. For running the project in NetWin IDE, just right click on the project. Just go on run. You can see here uh, default my uh, default is Firefox. So project will. Uh, run on a uh, firebox so, okay this is my existing project in the last video i show you how this project will work for uh, online voting system same thing i added here admin check result after the voting system after the complete voting the admin will going to check the users or uh, check the results so admin is first uh, uh, admin has to click on this admin check result when admin has to log in so the default password is admin and the default username is admin and password is password then uh, user uh, admin going to log in so here you can see the result uh, there is a two vote to bjp five vote to congress and one vote to up okay so easily admin can log out here if user uh, admin want to see other things admin can see like i uh, hello home, home page and uh, it's not uh, going to log out here so about is all it's still login log out it's still log out is here when is when admin is going to log out is automatically redirect on home page again admin going to login password again you can uh, his session is started okay you can see the result so I'm going to show you the database so for database uh, interface I'm using uh, MySQL workbench as always I use Here is my voting database. In this database, there is a table vote. So I'm going to see the data of vote. Select a stick from vote. So here you can see the data. And the next thing is that uh, what how the project user will vote in this project. You can see my previous video. I'm going to show you one more demo. So just uh, first of all, uh, user has to uh, register uh, his uh, uh, his voter card, and then okay. So I'm going to register a new idea. Like new is S D F. Last name is uh, some valuable name like uh, Sonu and uh, Sonu Patel. The second username. Voter card no, number is like any unique number, so no 345 native address, anything you want like Chennai date of birth, so no state of birth 1101 and uh, 1992 1993 anything contact number, any 10 digit number, email ID, so no. Okay, I had 
complete email id like sunu at the rate gmail.com some validations are there so and next just sunu is going to click on register he is registered successfully you can check the register table here now voter register so i'm going to execute this voter register something is wrong here voter okay this voter okay here is a entry you can see the seventh number entry is sonu patel sonu uh, the voter card number is sonu 345 and all the details uh, now uh, sonu going to log in so he has to enter his uh, uh, voter card number it's going to log in uh, one on this mobile number which sonu updated in uh, the database the one otp is sent by the java and for example otp is like 5762 and sonu is going to proceed for again sonu has to write his uh, um, voter card number for uh, voting to any party so sonu is going to vote a party like uh, up <coughs> or any party Sonu is going to vote, okay, and uh, again Sonu is deradicted, okay. So we can see the database. The Sonu's ID is seven, and in the vote table, select a stick from vote. Sonu three four five. This is voter card number and voted to up. So easily user can vote now if sonu want to again vote on that particular number sonu can can because uh, for every unique user vote is allowed like sonu sonu 35 for the same id same voter card if sonu is going to vote it's not allowed to sonu sorry vote is allowed only once you are already used this voter card number so every time he has to uh, user a, a unique user only vote that number and um, when user is going to be uh, when user is uh, when now uh, if admin want to see the result so you can see the admin table here login admin login there is some validation like username is admin and password so user on admin only uh, login by this credential and then it's login there is a vote is like uh, 3 and 5 and 1 so something is wrong here because I voted to up and it's going to show 1 so you can change the sequence only in my code Just wait. I'm going to sort out this man. Up has only one, two, and three vote. Okay. BJP has a one, two, three, four, and five vote. Okay. So up is right now, and this is for BJP second index. This is for Congress. So I'm going to show this message to in front of Congress. Okay. Now we are going to see the result. Let's reload this page. Oh, something wrong. So you can see the five vote to BJP, one vote to Congress, and three vote to R. In database also you can see the BJP vote is like uh, one. 2, 3, 4, and last 5. And you can see the R port is here. 1, 2, and 
one more on the top I think yeah three and the next one is for Congress there is only BJP only one vote okay so thank you so much for watching if you like my videos please subscribe my channel on the below the video description uh, below the video this, there is a button right button you can just click it for more videos for more no, uh, more notification if you if you want and uh, if you want the source code about this complete project uh, with database uh, and uh, you can check below the video there is a link from which you can download the video uh, that the code easily and import in your project and you can use the code anywhere you want uh, you can submit it in your college days in your college as a minor or major project if you if you have any problem to configure the project you can uh, comment me uh, i will try to solve it thank you so much